What is going on YouTube? What is up? It is your boy Omni Gamer. I am here today on the channel. Today we are checking out the trailer for the potential of Devil May Cry 6 main character, new story, and more. Um, I guess this is supposed to be a trailer or something. Um, if you guys did not know, I actually am a massive, massive Devil May Cry fan. I have played every single DMC game. Including the shitty one that we all know about. Y'all know which one I'm talking about. But I'm here for it, man. Um, I do own number five with the Virgil DLC. So we're about to get right into this, man. This is the potential of Double May Cry 6, the main character, new story, and more. Who knows? We may get some reveals. Who knows, man? There may be some leaks in here. But if you guys do, I just be sure to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell found all down below to stay up to date with everything on the channel, Omni Gamer. And with that being said, let's get into this, man. It's now been four years and soon to be five since the release of Devil May Cry 5. This game is something I can easily fanboy about 24-7, but with it being the most sold DMC game of all time with 6 million copies being sold, not including Facts. the special edition of the game, many fans are wondering what is next for the series. Dante and Virgil's rivalry is still going on, but the relationship between those two seem to be a lot more stronger than ever, and with them having to use the Yamato to seal away the Underworld portal, it leaves questions whether if DMC 6 will involve one of the greatest rivalries in video game history. History, or if it will be the beginning of someone we are familiar with reaching new demonic powers while the franchise is in those hands in particular. Now as I said before, it's been 4 years, but it took Capcom 11 years to create the game after DMC4, that as they were true. making the reboot that came out in 2013. After the reception of fans not liking the game, more so the story and characters itself, Capcom may be scrapping everything that has involved that and may be going full focus on the main story, which I'm pretty sure it won't be taking another 11 years to make DMC6. Nero not. saying that they can't come back after sealing the portal is interesting to talk about now, but if Virgil always found a way to come back to fight Dante, I'm sure both of them can return probably fighting each other, but you get the point. Now, I'm sure everyone is aware of the new DMC anime coming out in the near future, but that yes. has nothing to do with what can happen in DMC. Side note, if y'all are excited for the new DMC anime, dude, put that shit in the comments, because I know I'm fucking hyped for that shit. I'm excited for the new DMC anime dropping on Netflix, dude. DMC 6, as I am 100% sure that the anime will not be taking place after DMC 5, and more so around the earlier parts of the timeline. So for those that know about me, I've been wanting to do this content for a long time and I'm still green as hell when it comes to DMC. I just got into the series with 5 and I have fallen in love with it. I kept on searching up lore videos and whatnot and it's just such a cool franchise to get into. But I put a community post talking about this topic last week and a few comments in particular stuck out to me and I'm glad I'm not the only one who thinks this because I really do hope that this will happen one day. We all know about the story and the legend of Sparta, the father of Dante and Virgil, and how he sealed the underworld and protected the human race and found love while doing so. I want a game of this and I really don't think many fans would turn it down, basically being oh, a prequel to what we know as Devil May Cry and we're just playing a full-fledged demon. What I would personally call the game would be something like Devil May Cry Origins of Sparta. If that would be the next game, I would have zero problem with that at all, and I would be fully intrigued by it. But in terms of the future of the series of after DMC5, that discussion will be going on for a while until the reveal of DMC6. I'm going to put out a bold prediction saying that Devil May Cry 6 will be announced in 2024. I really do believe it and I am going to stick with it. I just think the reception and love for DMC5 helping this franchise will want the team to make more DMC games. It brought the popularity to New Heights being the franchise's most sold game, and personally for me, one of if not the most fun action games I've ever played in my life. Do I think DMC6 should happen? I mean, yeah, with a- He is right on one thing, dude. Like, I got a feeling that it is going to be revealed this year, for sure. Like, because if you look- at the Devil May Cry games, they have never really let down on anything. Like he said, except for that one remake that nobody really got into. And bear in mind, I'm one of the biggest Devil May Cry fans out there, dude. Like, I have played all the games I've back in my earlier days on YouTube. I made a lot of AMVs around Double May Cry, around all the games. 
So to see them go in a new direction, I don't know. I think it would be very interesting to see. I'm definitely excited, man. I hope they do. If they do go in a new direction, man, I think it'll be something, like he said, you know, going back to the original roots of, you know, Sparta and all of that. Like, going back to things before Dante and Virgil were born, I think that would be a very, very interesting, that would be a very interesting concept. I really do think that that would be an interesting concept for them to go back to the original roots of where everything began. Like, how did Sparta come about? How did, you know, everything start? I think that would be an interesting concept. Or if not that, did Dante have a kid? Did he find and revive his wife? Like, what happened? Like, who knows? Like, there's a lot of directions that they could potentially go. No question. There is a large bunch of people that finally want Lady and Trish to be playable characters, and there yes. are some people that want a DMC game where Virgil is the main character of the story, rather than just dropping him into the original main story of just being- Now, I'm not gonna lie. I know I thought this was game, but dude, having Virgil as a main character would be interesting. Having Lady Trish- or even Virgil, like he said, as a main character, that would be interesting. That would actually be an interesting concept. Let me know in the comments, would you guys want to see a DMC game where Virgil is the main character? Being a part of special editions, but actually, you know, being the main protagonist. Which would be pretty cool after, you know, how often he's been the antagonist, but yeah, yeah you got the point. But in terms of what Capcom could possibly do for DMC6, take your time with that if you want. But Hideaki Itsuno is working on Dragon's Dogma 2 as of right now, so maybe it'll be 2025, but we'll see what happens. My next DMC video will be discussing if remakes will happen in this series, and I hope you guys stay tuned for that. But more importantly, thank you guys for watching, as it means a lot. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on it, as it helps to reach the YouTube algorithm, and subscribe to the channel for more DMC content in the near future. As always, I will catch you guys in my next video. Peace out, and much love. Put in the comments, man. I'm excited for that, man. Put in the comments. Are you guys excited for a Devil May Cry 6? And if there is going to be a DMC 6, who should the main antagonist and protagonist be? Should Virgil be the main character for DMC 6? Or, in, like, who do you think should be the new main character? character for number six i think personally doing virgil as the main character would be definitely interesting myself i think that would be a great direction to take in myself but we'll have to wait and see hopefully we do get an announcement sometime this year because we're already nearing we're already in the end of may going into june man hopefully we get an announcement sometime this year, man. Hopefully we get that. If we do, that'll be awesome. But uh, with that being said, I love you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. Let me know in the comments, man. Who would you guys like to see as a main character for the next Devil May Cry? What direction do you think they should go? And all that fun stuff. And uh, yeah, if there is any information new dropping, I will let you guys know. I will be dropping everything in the community tab here within the next few days. That is going to be a thing. So if you guys do want to check out the latest leaks, I will be dropping that for you guys. And uh, yeah, I will catch you guys right here next time on On The Gamer. As always, stay humble, stay positive, keep being yourself. And as always, stay ghostly. I love you guys. I'm out of here, y'all. Peace.